Welcome students, we got an interesting question. We are expected to integrate integral 0 to pi over 2, 1 over 1 positive tan x raised to the power of root of pi and you have the differential operator dx. So we are expected to integrate this. So how are we going to do this? Now foremost, I would like to bring your attention to the King's property. If we were to be given like this, integral a to b f of x dx, then this could be rewritten as integral a to b f of a positive b negative x times dx. This is the property known as the King's property which we will be applying. So what we will do is in place of x we will be substituting 0 positive pi over 2 negative x. So that would mean we would be replacing it with pi over 2 negative x. Okay. Now let me just consider the integral. Let us consider i to be equal to integral 0 to pi over 2 dx divided by 1 positive tan x raised to the power of root of pi. So this is what we have been given. Now if I apply the King's property this is going to be equal to integral 0 to pi over 2 dx divided by 1 positive tan in place of x is going to be pi over 2 negative x this is raised to the power of root of pi okay so this is what we have got now we need to know what is tan of pi over 2 negative x now there is a formula tan of a negative b is equal to tan a negative tan b divided by 1 positive tan a tan b now we are expected to find tan of pi over 2 negative x so this is going to be tan pi over 2 negative tan x divided by 1 positive tan pi over 2 times uh, tan x. Now we take tan pi over 2 outside so it's going to be 1 negative tan x over tan pi over 2 divided by we take tan pi over 2 outside so it's going to be 1 over tan pi over 2 plus tan x. Now tan pi over 2 tan pi over 2 gets cancelled giving you 1 negative tan x divided by tan pi over 2 divided by 1 over tan pi over 2 positive tan x. Now tan pi over 2 is equal to or in other words so when we take the value of tan pi over 2 it will become infinity. So 1 over tan pi over 2 will actually tend to 0. That in other words if you were to write tan x over tan pi over 2 as uh, tan x times 1 over tan pi over 2, you are going to be getting over here infinity. So 1 over infinity will be 0. So that means this entire component 1 over tan pi over 2 will be 0. So since it is 0 here, this entire thing is 0, 0 times tan x is going to give us 0. So this one vanishes. Now similarly this one vanishes so you got 1 over tan x. So this will lead us to 1 over tan x. But what is 1 over tan x? You can simply substitute it as a 1 over tan x and uh, we can move on from there. Okay so I will just settle it with 1 over tan x. Now let me go to the next uh, side of the paper and uh, I mean uh, another new sheet and continue. So now what we have got here is this is equal to integral 0 to pi over 2 you got dx divided by 1 positive 1 over tan x now this is raised to the power of root of pi okay so that is what we have got now what I want to do is I would like to take the LCM so let me rewrite that statement this is equal to integral 0 to pi over 2 dx divided by 1 positive 1 over tan x raised to the power of root of pi now if I were to take the LCM this is going to be giving me tan x raised to the power of root of pi plus 1 divided by tan x raised to the power of root of pi. Now you have a dx there and a limit 0 to pi over 2. Now if you were to flip this, this is going to give me integral 0 to pi over 2 tan x raised to the power of root of pi divided by 1 positive tan x x raised to the power of root of pi. Now on the left you got i. Now but we already, let me take this as 2. Already we started by taking, let us consider 
this to be as i let we are taking this to be as 1 now what i'm going to do i'm going to add 1 with 2 so add 1 with 2 so on the left you got 2i on the right first component is this right substitute that so it's going to be integral 0 to pi over 2 dx divided by 1 positive tan x raised to raised to the power of root of pi plus second component is this so 0 to pi over 2 tan x you have a dx there so that is raised to the power of root of pi times the dx over 1 positive tan x raised to the power of uh, root pi so you add both the things you get integral 0 to pi over 2 1 positive tan x raised to the power of root of pi divided by 1 denominator is common 1 positive tan x raised to the power of root of pi multiplied with dx right so numer uh, denominator and numerator gets cancelled giving you integral 0 to pi over 2 dx you integrate you get x 0 to pi over 2 so substitute upper limit minus lower limit ok so that is the solution for this beautiful question please like share and subscribe thank you